Hey guys. Welcome to couple. Please like and subscribe if you like this video. Florida has three top Democratic contenders for governor. And each of them is employing a different strategy in how to approach President Donald Trump. The race's top candidates former Representative Gwen Graham, former Miami Beach Mayor Philip Levine, and Tallahassee Mayor Andrew Gillum all are campaigning hard for the Democratic mantle in a state the president won in 2016. Graham's early campaigning has been heavy on anti-Trump rhetoric, Levin's has been very light, and Gillum's balancing somewhere in between. Since the primary isn't until August 28th and polling shows voters aren't especially familiar with any of the candidates Florida may offer a great look at what Democratic voters really want from their candidates when it comes to a central question hanging over the party's national politics, how best to run against the president. We don't yet know what works as it relates to Trump, said Ashley Walker, a top Democratic strategist who was Barack Obama's Florida state director in 2012. He is a brand unto himself and has been fairly successful at rising above political party and establishment, so it's hard to say what will work against him. In Florida, the Democratic candidates' decisions on Trump speak more to their personalities than they do to party doctrine, she said. I don't think there's a right way or a wrong way to do it. The race promises to be expensive and closely watched, as well, especially by those with a potential stake in running against Trump next time. Already, Julian Castro has endorsed Gillum calling him the Democrat with the courage of conviction, even when it's not politically convenient and Kirsten Gillibrand has thrown her support behind Graham. In a statement, a DGA spokesperson, Jared Leopold, noted that the general election would be highly watched, and that voters across the country, especially in Florida, are looking for governors who will stand up to bad policies coming out of Washington. In practice, Gillum is campaigning for governor as a progressive populist. He likes to say on the trail that he understands the lived experience of ordinary, working-class Floridians, and contends he is the only non-millionaire in the race. One of Hillary Clinton's more effective messengers in 2016, Gillum said in an phone interview with BuzzFeed News that Democrats already ran against Trump and his message in 2016. He thinks turning out voters is the most important thing he can do to win, and while he won't take hitting Trump off the table completely, he said liberals, and voters of color in particular, don't need to be reminded that Trump's policies are bad for Florida.